Greetings, it's the 7th of July as I record this, and here we are sitting in the Okanagan with sunshine, and I never thought I'd see the day I'd think, oh, it's only going to 30 today, so it's quite cool out there. But that's where we're at, still having 30 degree days, pleasant, cooler evenings, and that's the Okanagan, perfect holidaying weather on the lakes. So state of the market, real estate, by the way, you'll notice we've got a little bit of a logo change there with a sold on Vernon team. And we're with Coldwell Banker Executives Realty right here in Vernon and covering the entire North Okanagan. What's happening with the market? Well, we'll talk about the absorption rate in more detail in a moment as usual, but it's 5.7 months of inventory. We've got 493 active residential listings, 141 new ones. High 86 sales the past month. This is the month of July, of course, we're talking about because we're in August. Average days to sell is up a bit at 62 days. And homes are selling for about 97.3% of their asking price. Benchmark price is 762000 That's, again, the benchmark price for a home in the Okanagan, in the Vernon, North Okanagan area, pardon me. And... You can also see the median price at 682, 750, and the average price 731. So depending on which one of those numbers you happen to be attracted to and like looking at, we've got them all here for you. Well, let's take a look at that absorption rate because the absorption rate continues to bounce around and we'll see just what that's doing. So here's our absorption rate. If we go back as far as July, June, August, actually 2022, all the way back here, that's when we started flirting with being in the balanced market. So again, between these two red lines is a balanced market. You can see we've gone above it briefly into buyer's market territory and over here in May, June, July of uh, 23, back into seller's market territory. But bottom line is, for the past two years, essentially, we've been flirting with staying within that balanced market zone. And we've done flips up and down like the last three months, four months. It's been up, it's been down, it's been up, it's been down. It's still flitting around inside that balanced market. So this month, that's where we're at. Just over five, 5.3 or so months of inventory. And that's a solid balanced market. We'll see what happens for the month of August. Maybe we'll bounce back up. Maybe we'll bounce back down. We just don't know right now. Predictions. What are was predicted for the fall? The predictions for the fall is that we'll have quite an active market with more homes coming on the market and more homes selling. So that's good news for everybody out there who's thinking about buying or selling. Let's take a look at that other graphic everybody seems to like. This is, oh, get to the beginning of it. It's the summary of the Association of Interior Realtors statistics to give us this beautiful graphic. Single family dwellings, we're looking here at the North Okanagan. The North Okanagan, we had those 86 sales I mentioned, 13.2% increase. That's an increase over July of last year. So it was very quiet last July. The benchmark price, $762,000, which is down 2.4%. So it's down a little bit on the benchmark price, but relatively stable. Days to sell up significantly, up 18.9% to 62 days on market and inventory up as well. Again, as I've said before, if inventory continues to go up, if sales were going down and inventory was going up, that absorption rate would slide up into the buyer's market territory into higher numbers, more homes above seven months of inventory. But that's not what's happening at this point in time. We're staying in that balanced market. Not single family. Looking at townhouses, what have we got? North Okanagan, sales down significantly 18.5%. Benchmark price down 7.3%. Days to sell here, 51. So you can see if we go back, that's selling a lot faster and it's actually a decline by almost you know, 8%, 8.4%. So 51 days to sell townhouse versus 62 days to sell a freestanding single family dwelling. And inventory is up. Apartments, stratified apartments, sales, 
it's a wash. It's the same as last year, 16 sold in the month of July. Benchmark price is down 3.3%. Days to sell are up. That's even higher at 81 days and 32.4% increase. And inventory, here we are, uh, up significantly, 44%. So that is a summary of the North Okanagan. So for you, helping you out, let's go back to that original page. Pardon me. Let me get on here. Click. So here we are. If you've got questions, you want to know more about the July statistics, or you want to know what's happening in your specific niche of the marketplace, we're here to give us give us a call. I'm Don Miller. I'm at Sold on Vernon team at Coldwell Banker Executives Realty right here in Vernon in the gorgeous North Okanagan. I'm working with Ben Dernfeld. Ben can answer any of your questions as well. So if you call either one of us, we're here to help. And we'll help you make your Okanagan lifestyle dreams come true. And come enjoy some of our sunshine. Meantime, I look forward to talking to you really soon. And if you're local, stay cool out there.